Yeah, you look good. Looks good? You look good. Doesn't sound good. <laughs> Dude, after 20 minutes, we're about to start. The moment we're about to start, they start to <laughs> sod. I haven't sawed for like 20 minutes, and just now they start. Uh, Timing. Cool. All right. What's up and welcome to another episode of Gizmo Slap. Today, we've got the iPhone SE Apple's latest budget smartphone. They just released it. Uh, mine took a few days to come in the mail, so sorry the drop is a little delayed. But either way, we're gonna find out how durable this smartphone is. I'm hoping we finally have a very durable budget phone because Apple's latest glass they've been using in the iPhone XS has been the most durable smartphone glass that I've seen in any smartphone so far. So if they translated that glass onto here, that would be two giant thumbs up. If it's the old glass from like the iPhone 6, which this borrows the design of, then it might be in trouble. Without further ado, it's gonna be freaking epic. Let's get started. So this iPhone SE has glass on the front and back. And the reason for this is because of the wireless charging, which is kind of scary though, for the drop test perspective. So hopefully this back glass is very durable. <laughs> you can no, that you <laughs> so we're gonna be drop testing this sucker ten times. We got a spotlight on my face because you always couldn't see my face at all, but now I can't see the camera. So three times bottom, three times top, one on each side, one on the front and back. We're probably gonna drop it on the back a bunch, front a bunch, for accidental drops all over the place. It's gonna be great. It'll break when it breaks or it doesn't break. If it doesn't break after ten, we're good. It beat us. The drop testers outsmarted, outdurbalized us. Otherwise, we beat it by dropping it. So, great. Let's drop test this sucker. <laughs> drop on the bottom in three, two, one. Excellent drop test, yes. <laughs> Okay, picking it up to check it out. We went to the uh, phone dial. Still looks looks pretty good. We just got a scuff right there. Oh, that's not too bad. That's not bad at all. Actually, that's very minimal damage. Trying another drop on the bottom. In three, two, one. are ba boom we got a little bit of dirt um but yeah that's that's not bad at all that's where we impacted so back glass still looks pretty perfect front glass we just have a few minor scrapes here and if this glass was weaker i could see this glass actually having shattered from these scrapes but the iphone survived drop on the bottom number three in three two one Here it is. Let's check it out. So the back is still looking pretty good. Don't see any cracks. The front also still looking good. The bottom, just minor scuffing still. Drop on the top in three, two, one. Woo, okay, that hit the top and then it kind of wiggled down. I'm not sure how the impact went. Let's take a look at the slow-mo. All right, let's see if it survived. Do it looks it looks good. We got the impact right there. Drop number five on the top in three, two, one. Uh, did did that destroy it? No, it did not. Phone's still looking pretty good. We just have some scuffing and some uh, some damage to the glass, but no glass cracking or shattering yet. So, giant thumbs up. Drop number six in three, two, one. <laughs> I think that flopped right down onto the front. <laughs> Here we go. It's alive still. I think that's where it hit on that one. So it hit the side and then flopped to the front. I think we're okay. We're still alive. 
We're kicking. Well, uh, hopefully we end up landing on the side instead of the back or the front. Drop number seven, attempting to hit the side. Three, two, one. All right, now I did review the footage and this did kind of hit the front side a little bit and then whip down onto the front and I'm really impressed. The front glass didn't shatter. So that's pretty huge actually, I think. Back glass, also looking still good. Drop number eight, eight, eight-ish, I think. On the left side in three, two, yikes. <laughs> <laughs> yikes. Okay, and uh, here we are. <sighs> oh my goodness. We have a cracked front screen. Look at that. It starts in the top left, goes all the way down to the right, and snakes down and around all the way over to here. Pretty insane uh, amount of damage. I mean, considering it survived eight drops, I'm actually impressed that it survived this long. This phone would still be pretty usable. This display seems to be working just fine, and this is not going to cut you, except maybe right there or up there. But... Yeah, you just want to be a little careful with this sucker and you still be able to use it. So let's go ahead and do a drop on the back glass and see if it breaks with a direct impact. All right, drop on the back glass in three, two, one. Taking a look, looksies. That's uh, that's a cracked, that's cracked uh, glass right there. Wow, really shattered around the camera bump, and then we have one big jaggedy long line coming out. Um, the rest didn't crack, interestingly enough. I think we kind of impacted right there. Yeah, I can feel the broken glass. So, you could definitely cut yourself with this in your pocket. Oh, and the front. Look at that. The front shattered even worse. <laughs> that's a surprise, actually. Yeah. Right. Here's the damage after nine drops. We've got the back shattered, we've got the front shattered. It survived seven drops, essentially semi-perfectly with only minor scuffing. And then on the eighth drop, we had a minor fracture. And then on the ninth drop, we had severe cracking on the front and back. So overall, I gave this like a B plus because some of the other phones that I've drop tested have shattered much sooner, especially when you drop it on the side, then it kind of whips down on the front and back glass, it still breaks. This one did not break from those types of drops, which is which is pretty good, not bad, uh, but it's still not perfect. And I want to see smartphone durability like get ramped up some more. We still need more durable glass on smartphones. Now, since this did fail our drop test, it's time to shatter the crap out of it. We've got an ultra slow motion camera to capture it in all of its glory, and it's gonna be glorious. Are you ready to see this thing get absolutely destroyed in ultra slow motion? Here we go. Three, two, one. Ooh. Wow. You hear that? That? I heard that. I heard, I saw a glass. I felt that a little <laughs> bit. I, feel, I didn't feel it, but I felt that in the proverbial sense. You felt it in your heart. Yes. <laughs> so did the audience. <laughs> <laughs> back way shattered and we even have pieces of glass missing oh look at that look the at that front oh. ah, the display is still on that's impressive actually uh not that we can see anything whoa it's actually like moving okay so there's the iphone se drop test i hope you enjoyed it if you did hit that like button and if you want to see more drop test reviews wacky videos hit that subscribe button hit that notification bell i'll see you in the next one everyone stay safe out there uh, don't be afraid to wear a mask. Wash your hands. Uh, masks will save lives in this pandemic. That's all I got to say about that.
Love you guys. Have a good one. Enjoy your video games while you can stay inside with a good excuse. Woo!